today's theme is comfort of the afflicted it is our duty to comfort the afflicted and to be a comforter of the afflicted we must have an understanding heart understanding is a gift of the holy spirit and we receive this gift at our baptism and we are born not only into our family but also we are born in the family of the human race therefore we have to assist the other members of the human race those who are afflicted physically spiritually they need us they need us in their affliction in the book of kings we find solomon praying to god the lord says to him solomon what should i give you peace in your time a triumph over your enemies wealth domestic happiness solomon asked for none of these things he asked for an understanding heart god god has pleased with his request and god gave him not only an understanding heart but also many other things let us now turn to mary the litany of our lady has the invocation the comfort of the afflicted pray for us comfort of the afflicted pray for us that clearly indicates she has an understanding heart the holy spirit gave her the gift of understanding the spirit of understanding shown in mary soon after she received the holy spirit luke chapter 1 verse 35 the holy spirit will come upon you and the power of most i will overshadow you neither the angel gabriel nor anyone suggested her to visit the six months pregnant elizabeth yet she undertook old age journey very difficult journey journey of 80 miles to be with elizabeth and the dumb zachariah to comfort them 
and comforting the aged couple was not uh, an easy assignment. When Christ was on the cross suffering, Mary, his mother, comforter of the afflicted, was there at his side. She was there at his side. She could do nothing to lessen the pain or stop the flow of blood. She was at his side. She was at his side as a as comforter of the afflicted. She just stood. She stood there, suffered with him for three hours. For three hours. Here, a lesson for us when we visit sick person who cannot be cured. To be a comforter of the afflicted, we just have to be there. We just have to be there. Let us implore. Let us implore her, implore her to be at our side and we will be able to bear our sorrow and our affliction. When we lose our loved ones, we need Mary. Standing, standing at the side of the sink is enough. Let us look into let us look into our own lives and see this understanding is very much lacking. Understanding within the family and us today in a special way Mary our mother to pray for you that the Holy Spirit may come upon you and make you like Mary a comforter of the afflicted comforter of the afflicted, pray for us, and comforter of the afflicted, pray for us. Amen. Let's all stand for creed.